Okay, five uh, five songs for Friday, and uh, this time again, I'm going to do uh, f- five songs from the '90s. I know last time I covered five songs from the '90s, but the '90s was one of my favorite periods for for rock music. The uh, I felt like the uh, the guitar kind of became center stage again in the '90s, and rock got a little bit harder. Uh, not that I didn't like the eighties, but, uh, I felt like some of the, uh, some of the music there was very keyboard based and a lot of synthesizers, drum machines, that type of thing. Uh, pop music was kind of very, very safe, so to speak. And then, you know, along came again, uh, Seattle, the grunge, uh, you know, grunge, grunge scene and that type of music. But just wanted to cover uh, five more songs here. And as far as my recording setup, for those that are interested, um, I'm kind of doing the same thing I did last time. I got two mics here, one for vocal, one for the guitar. I'm not plugged in. Recording everything on my Tascam Model 12. And uh, I'll probably, you know, mix it on there. And again, I did uh, a couple weeks back, I did a whole video on my uh, recording process. Uh, so if there's any any folks that are new to recording and you want to check that out, it is a little bit long. I apologize, but uh, you know it might be might be helpful. And uh, I guess uh, yeah, let's get going here. First thing I'm going to do is <clears throat> put my headphones on so I can monitor myself and uh, start off with uh, one of my favorite songs. I think it came out in 1991. This is Toad the Wet Sprocket. Uh, walk on the ocean, and every time I hear this song, I I, I literally feel like um, I'm out on a boat in the middle of the ocean. <laughs> the way the uh, the way the bass kind of just rocks you, so to speak. Uh, I'm gonna play this uh, for the guitar players out there. I'm gonna play this in the same key, but uh, for the singers out there, I'm probably not gonna sing it in the in the right key. But we'll go we'll give it my best here. I certainly can't sing it as as high as uh, the guy did on the original. But uh, here we go. We spotted the ocean at the head of the trail. We knew we were going so far away. Somebody told me that this is the place. Everything's better if everything's safe. Walk on the ocean, step on the stone. Flesh becomes water, wood becomes bone. Half an hour later, we packed up our things. Said we'd send letters and all those little things. We knew we were lying to smile just the same. Seen they've forgotten, forgotten we could. Walk on the ocean, step on the stone. Flesh becomes water, wood becomes bone. Walk on the ocean, step on the stones. Flesh becomes water, wood becomes bone. Homestead, where the air makes you choke. When people don't know you, and trust is a joke. When even have pictures, just memories to hold. Grow sweeter each season, as we slowly grow old. Walk on the ocean. 
step on the stones, flesh becomes water, wood becomes bone. Walk on the ocean, step on the stones, flesh becomes water, wood becomes bone. are down here, which is why I keep uh, facing the left. And uh, I will say, uh, as, a, as a guitar player trying to play and sing that song, uh, each verse, uh, it's a little bit different, like the second verse, uh, as far as how you play the, play the guitar. There's this little walk-up thing, but at any rate, I can get very confused at times and mess it up, but I... I think I made it through that particular one. So I'm switching guitars here because my the next song uh, is a half a step down. And I already have this tune, the half step down. And this is uh, this is my brother-in-law's his old uh, Guild D55. I think it's from 1978. And when this guitar is in the right mood, it can, it can literally sound like a piano, uh, if it's in the right mood. <laughs> sometimes it is, sometimes it, it isn't. Uh, and I think the strings are probably on here from 1978, so it may not be sounding its, its best. But uh, we'll, we'll give this a shot here. This is, this is Nirvana, a uh, great song. That I, I don't know if it came out in 93. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's dumb. So let me see if I can, uh, if I can handle this one. I'm not like them. I can pretend the sun is gone. But I have a light. The day is done. And I'm having fun. Think that I'm dumb. Maybe just happy. Think I'm just happy Think I'm just happy My heart is broke But I have some glue Help me inhale Mend it with you We'll float around Hang on a cloud Then we'll come down Have a hangover Have a hangover have a hangover Skin the sun Fall asleep Wish away Soul is cheap Lessons learned Wish me luck Soothe the burn Wake me up I'm not like them I can pretend The sun is gone I have a light the day is done, I'm having fun, think that I'm dumb, maybe just happy, think I'm just happy, think I'm just happy, think I'm just happy, think I'm just happy. I think I'm dumb, I think I'm dumb, I think I'm dumb, I think I'm dumb. I think I'm done, I think I'm done, I think I'm done, I think I'm done. Okay, a uh, little quick thing about that song. About 10 years ago, I, I did an open mic, first time I ever did one, and actually almost pretty much the last one. <laughs> and uh, 
I don't know if anyone's ever gone to an open mic before, but usually, uh, you know, guitar players, singers come in there and they'll do, they'll do you know, usually no more than three songs each. And, you, you know, each person goes up there, you know, and they do their three songs and the next person goes up. And uh, it can be very, very, uh, very, uh, you know, in intimidating, uh, at least for, for me, because, you know, you know some, some of those players out there are, are pretty good, so I become very self-conscious of, of my, my playing. So I only did this this song, and I didn't even sing it. Uh, there was uh, you know, a woman that I'm friends with. She sang it, and she could you know, do a much, much better job than me. But the scary thing was, was uh, so this one guy went up, and uh, again, there's people playing. They're all different levels. You know, some are beginners, intermediates, and some are really like pros. And one guy got up right before me, and uh, you know he was sort of a beginner and struggled a little bit. And the guy next to me, who uh, who was really good, he's like, "Man, that guy was freaking terrible." And I'm thinking, "He was terrible. Wait till I get up. I'm I'm like next." <laughs> At any rate, I got up there, and uh, yeah, it went went okay because luckily uh, I wasn't doing the the singing, but. Uh, it is all it is all fun, but it can can be uh, scary scary doing that. So, I'm going to uh, I'm going to turn up my headphone level just slightly here. Testing. Okay, I think that's a little better. So let me uh, let me switch back. Uh, another great 90s song. Uh, this is Tom Petty, Mary Jane's Last Dance. I don't know if this was 92 or 93. I'm not, not sure. Uh, but here we go. In the Indiana town Had a good looking mama Never was around But she grew up tall And she grew up right With the Indiana boys On the Indiana nights Yeah Well she moved down here At the age of 18 She moved the boys away It was more than they'd seen I was introduced Both started grooving Said I dig it baby But I gotta keep moving on Keep moving on Last dance of Mary Jane One more time to kill the pain I feel summer creeping in And I'm tired as town again I don't know, but I've been told He never slow down and he never go on Tired of screwing up, tired of going down I'm Tired of myself, I'm tired of this town Oh my my, oh hell yes Honey, put on that party dress Buy me a drink, sing me a song Take me as I come, cause I can't stay long Last dance of Mary Jane One more time to kill the pain Summer creeping in and I'm tired as town again. There's pigeons down in Market Square. She's standing in her underwear Looking down from a hotel room Nightfall be coming soon Oh my my, oh hell yes You gotta put on that party dress It was too cold to cry when I woke up alone Hit the last number, walked to the road Last dance of 
Mary Jane One more time to kill the pain I feel summer creeping in And I'm tired as hell again Now I'm going to uh, drop down this E string down to a D. I think they call it drop D. A lot of times uh, I only drop the uh, the bass uh, E string down. I don't drop the high E. Although technically, I guess you, you should. But uh, this next one uh, is Neil Young, Harvest Moon, in a, I think one of the, probably one of the greatest, uh, or one of the top, I'll say, love songs uh, back in the 90s. A uh, little bit of a country uh, feel to it. So uh, let's, uh, let's give this one a shot. Come a little bit closer Hear what I have to say Just like children sleeping We could dream this night away There's a full moon rising Let's go dancing in the light We know the music's playing Let's go out and feel the light I'm still in love with you I want to see you dance again Because I'm still in love with you On this harvest moon When we were strangers, I watched you from afar. When we were lovers, I loved you with all my heart. It's getting late The moon is climbing high I want to celebrate See it shining in your eyes Cause I'm still with you I want to see you dance again 
Because I'm still in love with you On this harvest moon Cause I'm still in love with you I want to see you dance again Cause I'm still in love with you On this harvest moon It's slightly sloppy on that one. The, the hardest thing for me, uh, especially if I'm playing in front of people, <laughs> is, uh, or even if I'm not, I'm just recording myself here with the camera on, is, is getting the right tempo. A lot of times I tend to uh, play things a little too fast, or like the last song I just loaded up, which was Man in the Box. I Started off fine, I thought, at the right tem tempo, but if you listen to the end of it, I'm, uh, I'm speeding it up. Uh, <clears throat> but, you know, it happens, happens to even the pros, but probably the tempo of that song, I don't know, maybe it should be a little slower. that? I don't know. Or maybe that's too slow. <laughs> okay, let's uh, <clears throat> go on to the last song here. Bring this back up again. So this last song I I did a version of this a couple months back, but like anything else, like 90% of the videos I ever put on YouTube, I always, I always feel I can, can do them a little, little better. Uh, but at any rate, this is uh, Closing Time by uh, Semisonic. Is that the name of the band, uh, if I'm pronouncing it right? And uh, every time I think of this song, and I'm sure it's like a lot of people, I always picture myself in a bar, you know, and that it's, you know, <laughs> closing time. And I think back to my, my, the old days when I would go out, you know, real late with my, my friends and, you know, come home, like whatever it was, three in the morning, go, go watch a band. And usually like, I don't know, maybe, uh, let's say the bar closed at like two o'clock at like 1.50 AM, they'd be saying, uh, last call, you know, last call for alcohol. So you'd get your drinks, and then two minutes later, they'd be saying, okay, everybody, uh, drink them up. Let's go. Let's go, everyone. Drink them up. And just in time for you to, you know, hop in your car and, and drive home. <laughs> uh, but, you know, yeah, hopefully uh, if you are out, you know, late, hopefully you're, you're not driving. You know, that'd be a stupid thing to do. But here's, uh, here's our closing time. Closing time Open all the doors And let you out Into the world Closing time Turn up all the lights On every boy And every girl Closing time Cut all your whiskey 
finish up all your gear closing time you don't have to go home but you can't stay me home and I know who I want to take me home and I know who I want to take me home take me home closing time time for you to go out to the places you will be from closing time this room will be open till your brothers or sisters come. So gather up your jackets, move it to the exits. I hope that you have found a friend. Closing time, every new beginning comes from some other beginnings. And yeah, and I know. Closing time, time for you to go out to the places you will be from. And I know who I want to take me home. And I know who I want to take me home. And I know who I want to take me home. Be home. And I know. Closing time, every new beginning comes from some of the beginnings end. Okay, I made a little mistake there in that little bridge part, <laughs> but uh, it is what it is, and I guess... Uh, uh, this this song, um, uh, the guy who who I guess who who wrote it uh, from the band. Uh, there's there's an acoustic version that he does, and he plays all the verses kind of with the bar chords, and then he does the chorus with the open chord chords. I kind of do it the opposite way. I'm also not sure if I'm quite quite strumming the pattern right compared to the original record. Uh, I may have to work on that some more, but uh, otherwise, you know, I don't know, maybe it's fine, but that's it. That's the end of uh, this episode of Five for Friday. Uh, the next one I think I'm going to do will be, I, I guess, uh, I think Friday, September 1st, and um, I'm going to uh, get out of the 90s <laughs> and uh, move back, uh, back to the 80s. I guess I'm going backwards here, so... Uh, yeah, so that will be the next one. Otherwise, uh, that's it. And uh, thanks for watching if you made it to the end. And uh, take care.